Hey you guys, it's Mrs. So Fabulous and I'm here to do a haul today. So right now I'm actually sitting on my bed filming this video. Um, I'm still in the process of my room is under construction. I'm still trying to decorate. So as soon as my room is finished decorating, I will have other areas of the room that I can film. But I decided, you know what, why not film on my bed? So I definitely splurged. Um, I'm not even going to say I did a little bit of shopping. I did a lot of bit of shopping. Um, I needed it. I mean, <laughs> I definitely needed it. I've been saying I need to get my house in order and I'm not going to buy that much clothes this this year around, but I can't help it. I can't, especially when you have the world of Instagram. You cannot freaking help it. You know what I'm saying? You see so many fashion posts and you're like, oh my God, I want that. I want that. I want that. That as soon as you come up on some money, what do you do? Buy clothes. So we're just going to start off with my haul. I'm going to start off with American Apparel. So I went shopping and I was on the hunt for a pair of high-waisted blue jeans. Can't seem to find them anywhere. You can find them in all rainbow colors everywhere else, but you can't just find simple blue jeans. So the only place I've been asking around, the only place that I seem to can only buy them is American Apparel. And I didn't want, and I did not, I did not want to pay damn near $70 not damn near $70. These pants were $70 for these jeans. But I bit the bullet anyways because I told myself, I said for $70 damn dollars, I will wear these jeans every damn day. And plus, like I said, there's so many outfits that I want to do with these pants. I figure why not make the investment because I'm going to wear them for the long run. So these are the jeans here. They're just a dark wash. And like I said, they're high-waisted denim. But these are the... What are these called? Da, 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 da. Oh, these are the American Apparel Easy Jeans. They have a high-waisted denim, but those are more like grandma high-waisted denim. Like, they're not snug on the on the calf or the ankle area. So they had these, which are called the Easy Jean, which is more like a, a jegging. And like I said, these jeans were $70. And I got mine in a size small. And also while I was at American Apparel, I picked up a pair of sheer tights. I've been on a hunt for a pair of sheer tights. I normally get my tights at TJ Maxx, but for some reason, I can't seem to find sheer tights in black. Um, they just seem to be sold out. So I bought some at American Apparel, and these babies were freaking $15.50. So for $15.50, these better not rip on me in one wear. So what the lady told me at the American Apparel store one tip that she did is actually hand wash her tights and just put them in a dryer instead of letting them go through the wash that she says that holds the longevity of her tights. So for $15.50, I better get at least 15 wears out of these tights. So I picked these up as well. Then I went to 2 BB outlet and I seen this really nice black bat wing sweater with studs on it and this is it. I thought it was super cute and it's still winter here in New England slash Massachusetts. I mean, I know a lot of people, you know, out west and down south is starting to get a little warmer for you guys, but not here. It is cold, baby Jesus, okay? We didn't have three damn snowstorms. So I picked up this Batwing sweater and I love the gold studs on it because I am a gold girl. The majority of my jewelry I wear is gold. So this sweater, I got this sweater in an extra small and this was $27.95. And then I also picked up a dress and they were having a President's Day sale. So it was 50% off their clearance and this dress was on the clearance. So this is the dress. It's a really pretty striped floral dress. And it's open in the back with this detail with the exposed zipper. Really cute, really nice. And this was on clearance for $24.95 plus 50% off of that so I definitely took advantage of this and I love dresses in the winter time but I've been on a hunt for sheer tights hallelujah about sheer tights so I can whip out some of my dresses and as the spring approaches as well so that was everything I got from 2D baby then I went to H&M and I picked up a few bits of goodies did I pick up a few goodies or am I lying my lion. Actually, I picked up two things from H&M because I have a whole bunch of stuff from Forever 21 in this bag for some reason. So what I had originally did 
What I had originally did was went to H&M and picked up a pair of sheer tights and don't ever go by the picture. I'm thinking since the picture is black that the tights will be black. No, I actually picked up a pair of sheer nude tights, so which is in light amber. Um, that's not going to do me no good. It's too light for my skin color. So I picked up this gorgeous leopard, black and white leopard dress. Really super elegant. This is the dress right here. Love it. It goes down to my knee. Very appropriate for the winter time. I wear a size 6 in H&M if you are wondering. And this dress was only $17.95. So definitely could not pass this dress up. And then also at H&M I picked up these high-waisted pants or leggings or jeggings. Whatever you want to call them. And this maroon color. These are really nice. Definitely gives me a booty. I mean, I have a booty, but it accentuates the booty. So I absolutely love these. And these were $24.95. Alrighty then. And then I stopped at Charlotte Russe. And I picked up some jewelry. Um, I don't tend to buy clothing at Charlotte Russe. I mainly only buy my jewelry in Charlotte Russe. Um... Maybe there'll be one every once in a while I may pick up some clothes. I definitely buy shoes in there um, every once in a while. But um, I picked up this ring right here. Just a really pretty rhinestone studded ring. And this ring, oh, you know all of their jewelry is 2 for 10. So I picked that up. And I'm a big fan of studs. So I picked up this set of studs right here. Then I did have another pair of studs on here and it had hoops, but I gave the hoops to my sister because I don't wear skinny hoops. I wear like the nice thick chunky hoops like you see I'm wearing, but I just mainly got these for the studs. And as you can see, I already wear a couple of the pair. I also got these rhinestone studded earrings. I meant these heart studded earrings. Then I picked up this three piece ring set, super adorable. It has like a cream bow on it. It has another ring that says love you and then just another um, middle ring with some cream accent details that match the bow. Then I picked up these silver hoops with the rhinestones on the front face of the hoops. And then I picked up these pretty coral light pastel pink studs. And then last but not least, I picked up these really pretty white earrings. So that's everything that I picked up from Charlotte Russe. And then we're going to move on to the drugstore. I didn't get too much stuff. Um, I went to Walgreens and... I seen, I, well what I ended up doing was, I purchased two more of the Wet n Wild, two more of the Wet n Wild lipsticks. Um, they were having a sale, 40% off all Wet n Wild cosmetics, which is crazy because everything's $1.99. So that means these $1.99 lipsticks were $1.17. So I have every single color, but they, that's in my kit. I use these lipsticks for my kit. But while I was doing one of the girls' makeup, and I used this pretty pink color right here, and this can't pink. Bleh. This pink is Dollhouse pink. I absolutely love the color, so I tried it on, and I was a huge fan. So I went and picked up one for myself, and then I also picked up this really pretty dark plummy wine red and. This color is called Sugar Plum Fairy, and this happens to be Beauty by JJ's favorite Wet n Wild lipstick. Also, what I picked up, I picked up two of the new Maybelline Color Sensational Lip Glosses. Now, these are super pretty, super opaque. Now, the only thing about the packaging, it's pretty plain and simple, and it's like once you rip the label off, that's it. There's no label on it. Um, all it has is just the name underneath it, so that kind of sucks. But the color I picked out is this pink right here, and this is 90 Electric Shock. And then the other one I got is this fuchsia purple color, and this one is 100 Raspberry Reflections. 
So that's everything that I picked up at the drugstore. Not a lot. Very simple. Then I stopped at Aldo. And um, Aldo wasn't really having too big of a sale. Uh, they had some really sexy shoes in there. But to have enough shoes for right now. And they're starting to bring out their summer shoes. And like I said, it's still winter here. So I didn't feel the need to even go grab anything. But what I need to buy more of is flats. I own one pair of flats and they're a leopard. So I seen these flats right here and I decided to pick them up. Really pretty. They're a satin finished shoe with black studs and rhinestone on the toe of the shoe. Now when I first put these on, I started cracking up laughing when I was looking at myself in the mirror. Because the first thing I thought of was these are the same shoes that Trinidad James was wearing in the... Um, all gold everything video I was dying laughing when I put these on but I decided to get these it was between these or the nude ones but I decided to just go with the all black because black goes with everything and like I said I already have a pair of leopard flats and I I feel like I wear the leopard ones when I wear more or earth tone colors and a black will just be you know an all-around everyday kind of shoe when I don't want to wear um, heels so now the bulk of the haul we are going to move on to forever 21 all right, so I have like three bags of Forever 21. I'm just gonna dump everything out on the bed. All right, so to start off with Forever 21, I'm wearing one of the shirts right now, and it's this top right here. It is a sheer black top, and I love the studded detail on the shoulder. Super edgy, really cute. Reminds me, I feel like very Michael Jackson-esque in this shirt. I love the cutout details right here. Um, that's what really, this right here in the studs really drew me to the shirt. This is the most expensive shirt that I own. Okay, this shirt was $32. I will never pay $32 damn dollars for a damn shirt. But this shirt I definitely couldn't pass up. Um, I have so many things that I could wear this with. I could wear this with a skirt, you know, some high-waisted pants, a lot of different varieties, um, some shorts with tights, so many different ways that I could rock this shirt. So I just decided, what the heck, it's a very unique shirt. I don't have anything in my closet like it, so I just decided to go ahead and get it. So this is the first item that I got. Then I got, you know, everything is in with those half tops, like, Everybody is rocking the half tops with the high-waisted skirts or the high-waisted pants. So I seen this high, I seen this crop top right here. And it's a simple black crop top with the rhinestones on the neck right here. And this top was $11.50. Then I picked up, oh my god, I forgot about this shirt. Because half of this stuff I bought about two weeks ago and then I went shopping again this weekend and just saved all of this stuff to make this haul. Then I purchased, I'm trying to zip it up for you, I purchased this gorgeous um, sweetheart peplum top and it is red with navy blue stripes and I decided to go, one, this is super cute on, but two, I don't own a lot of red stuff. I probably own two shirts that are red so I wanted to just incorporate more red into my wardrobe because red does complement my skin tone. So I picked this really pretty top up right here. And this top was $17.80. Then I picked up another peplum top because peplum is really big right now. I picked up this navy blue sleeveless peplum top with the studs around the collar as well really pretty love it and it has the silver ex um, exposed zipper in the back it fits so beautifully um, this will go super cute you can dress this up dress it down the fabric makes it look more dressy to me um, I could see me wearing this with a really nice nude skirt um, or I could throw this on with some jeans um, really pretty I mean throw a blazer on with this a crop leather jacket super cute and this top was $17.80 as well. Then Forever 21 was having their President's Day sale and it was 50% off the clearance. So I picked it, I picked up this royal blue dress and this is a long sleeve dress. I love long sleeve dresses. And this is it right here. It's a really pretty gorgeous dress and this dress was only $11.99 plus 
50% off, you do the math. So I loved how it complimented my body. When I came out of the dressing room in this, the sales associate was like, yes, Diva, you need to get that. Yes. So I don't know where the hell I'm going in this dress, but I got it just in case. Then I picked up another sweater because like I stated, you know, it's still winter time here. And I wanted to incorporate more sweaters in my wardrobe like I stated in my last haul. 50% of my wardrobe are sheer blouses like this. So I picked up another sweater and it's this really pretty pink and white polka dotted sweater. Nothing to it. It's just really cute. You know, just for those days where I don't want to be too cute, but I still want to be a little bit cute and just throw on some jeans and some boots and just go. So I got this sweater and this sweater was $17.50. Then I picked up this really pretty cropped top again. This is a sleeveless crop top. It's just plain black with polka dots. And this top was $6.50. I thought this would be really cute to wear with some high-waisted riding pants and a cropped leather jacket. Or wear this with a really nice skirt. You know, so many different ways that you can wear this. Once again, throw on a blazer with this as well. Then I picked up another crop top. And this is a royal blue and black striped crop top. And this top was $9.50. Then I purchased these white denim pants with the black stripe. You've seen these everywhere. All of the celebrities are wearing them. I believe the first person I seen wear this was, um, what's her name? What is her name? The girl that used to be the host on 106 and Park, Roxy. Yeah, I believe I seen her wear these first and now I see everybody wearing them. So I purchased a pair of these and I'm a size 27 in jeans if you are wondering and these jeans were $24.80. Now they had um, a pair like this in H&M but I believe they were like $49 so $24.80 is not a bad price so I definitely picked these up. And to go with those pants I seen this gorgeous a blazer. Wait till y'all see this blazer. Okay. Check this blazer out. Isn't this gorgeous? And it drapes down longer in the front and it's cropped in the back. But as soon as I seen this, I said, oh my God, that's going to go great with those pants. Because like the pants have the black detail going down the side, the blazer has the detail going down the side as well. So I was like, oh my God, that is going to be one hot outfit when I wear it. So I purchased this and this was the only one and this is a size small and this was $37.80. Now I wouldn't originally pay $37.80 for a blazer but for this one, hell yes. Then I purchased this really pretty um, sleeveless dress. It's really, it's simple, but I love the pattern that it had on it and it fits me so well. Once again, I can pull this off in the winter time, wear this with a crop leather jacket. Um, I also have a red leather jacket and pull some of the reds out in this um, pattern. Um, throw this on with a blazer, some tights, some riding boots, um, and call it a day. And this dress was $19.80. And is that it? I believe that is it. I don't see anything else. I hope I'm not forgetting anything. But yeah, you guys, that concludes my haul. I told you I didn't do a little bit of shopping. I did a lot of bit of shopping. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, remember to always rate, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, twitter.com backslash missiles of fabulous TV. Facebook, facebook.com backslash missiles of fabulous. Remember, you guys have a nice and wonderful day. Bye.